Welcome to the Sunday Shave of the Day, Episode 1. Hey, Eric here with Adventures in Wet Shaving, and welcome back. If this is your first time here and you're interested in learning how to straight razor shave, go ahead and hit that subscribe button. Then click on the bell next to it to be notified when I upload videos. That way you won't miss a thing. Now tonight, we are using my Parker, and this is the best silver steel. And this is just a brilliant razor. Look at that. Quarter hollow. Beautiful. And it is Swedish steel. Yeah, check that out. Good stuff. All right. And it really is a nice shaving razor. Now for a soap tonight. Sterling Soap Company, Gatlinburg. And this is brilliant. This is like uh, walking in the woods to me. I really enjoy being in the woods, and that's what it's like. Now, I have had that puck blooming, so we're going to pour off that bloom water and put that on its pre shave. Oh, yeah, nice. Really nice. I enjoy this scent. I enjoy being out in the woods. There we go. All right. Now, for a brush tonight, we're using my Omega 10,098. And let's get that loaded up. All right, so how are you guys doing? It's the weekend, which is marvelous. And hopefully you're having some downtime, being able to uh, relax and enjoy. Uh, maybe some time with your family and friends. Yeah, hopefully that would be good. So, you know, I don't know if you have anything planned for the weekend or if you've already been out doing stuff, but... That's all good, really is. Now, oh, I also wanted to remind you that uh, down in the comments, I do have a whole bunch of links there for you that I think you'll find helpful. So go e explore and see what you can find. All right. Now, I think we're pretty much there. Look at that. Nice. Just going to clean up around the bowl like normal all right and put that right on nice there we go okay now let's get it on here stuff. This Sterling Soap Company makes marvelous soaps. Yep. A little more water on that. Oh yeah. There we go. Hmm. Now, this is the Sunday Shave of the Day, and this is episode one, which means this is with the grain. So I'm going to be going north to south, pretty much, straight down here, and then I'm going to go across here on my cheeks, and then here on my neck, that's actually going to be across the grain. All 
And I got a little spot right there. Um, I scratched it or something. I'm not sure what it is, but it's kind of tender. So I'm going to kind of be ginger when I get around that area. There we go. Nice. Look at the soap. Isn't that nice? Just marvelous. Good cushion. Really slick. This is a, a tallow based soap. So it's hard to beat that for slickness. It's like I got a little too close there. Yep. Trying to uh, work on getting that part of my mouth a little bit better. So we're gonna just throw a little, a little alum on that. And that'll be fine, no big deal. All right, now, switching hands. And I'll try to not make the same mistake on the other side of my mouth. Okay. Stretching is so important. You know, you can't overstretch. Because that'll just give you ingrown hairs. But you got to stretch enough to get that skin nice and taut.
There we go. Nice. Okay, let's finish this off. All right, feel like I did better on that side. So that's good. Okay, now let's go ahead, get that washed off, see how we did. Oh yeah, nice. Good beard reduction. That's what we're looking for. All right. Coming up next is a pass and a half. I hope to see you there. You can click here to see that. Click down here on the video specially picked out for you. Click over here on me. Subscribe, like, comment, share this video with your friends. Have a great shave and a good day. And I will see you next time on Adventures in Wet Shaving.